In this video, we're going to be adding an enum for the order status. So we're going to say PHP has to make enum order status. And we're going to go ahead in here as well. And now let's copy and paste the product status for now. Add that in and call this order status. And inside this order status, we need to have for now a uh, we can add more enums in here, but I'm just going to go ahead and have a pending out for delivery cancelled. And let's go ahead and make sure we also have in here delivered and dispatch. So let's make sure we call this out for delivery pending cancelled delivered and we also want to have a dispatch one in here and then we can go ahead and create a new migration in here say php and make migration add order status to orders table Inside the order status, we can then go ahead and add that in. So all we want to do in here is just have a status in here with order status, and we want this to be default of pending. Upon down, we want to have table drop column status, and that's it. So let's go ahead and make sure we migrate this now. And that will now allow us to at least set an order status and it's always going to start as pending. But we can also change this to cancel, alpha delivery, or dispatch, and so on. And we're just using the options case again and the values case again for a filament and for the migration system here. So let's take a look at what it looks like in the database now. And there we go. So we have the orders table now and we have a status here as well. So we could go ahead and just roll this back and to tidy this up a little bit, I want to have this instead after a specific column. And in this case, I want this to be after the total column, just so that it doesn't go after the creator add and update that. Just like that. And if we then go ahead and look now, it should have moved, but doesn't look like it has, so if we go ahead and delete this here, go to migrations, delete this bit, still seems to be added there, so I'm not entirely sure um, why it goes, why it doesn't go after the total column, but we will leave it at that for this video. Thank you very much for watching it. Please hit the like and the subscribe button, and I'll see you in the next video.